Good morning, CPC family. It's good to be here with you again today. Today is 19, day 19 of our Grow Along. Today we'll be reading from Colossians chapter 2, verses 16 to 23. And today I will be reading in the Tree of Life version. I really like this version. It's, um, it's, a, it's a, I don't know, I just like it. Before we come to it, though, let's, uh, let's just pause ourselves. Let's just still our hearts and minds. Let's take a deep breath in and out together, uh, knowing that for the next little while, um, yeah, we don't have any jobs to do. Just sit and soak in um, the love of our Heavenly Father. Therefore, do not let anyone pass judgment on you in matters of food or drink, or in respect to a festival or new moon or Sabbath. These are a foreshadowing of things to come, but the reality is Messiah. Let no one disqualify you by insisting on false humility and worship of angels, going into detail about what he has seen, puffed up without cause by his fleshly mind. He is not holding fast to the head. It is from him that the whole body, nourished and held together by its joints and tendons, grows with a godly increase. If you died with Messiah to the basic principles of the world, why, as though living in the world, do you subject yourself to their rules? Don't handle, don't taste, don't touch. These all lead to decay with use, based as they are on man-made commands and teachings. Indeed, these are matters that have an appearance of wisdom in self-made religion and humility and self-denial of the body, yet none are of any value for stopping indulgence of the flesh. Let's pray together. Heavenly Father, we come to you today remembering that uh, we need so often to repent of our own religion, that it's not our man-made rules or our own work or our own ideas that draw us closer to you, but it is only you and your love, your sacrifice that you made for us that draws us close to you, Father. 
that it is only by the free gift of grace that we have been saved and nothing else at all. There's nothing we can rely on that's made of our own hands. Father God, we just lift your name up high, wanting the whole world to see what a loving and merciful Father you are. We pray these things in the precious name of Jesus. Amen. Well, CPC family, an interesting version of these verses, I think. Um, I remember when we read these before in our Paul along. Um, yeah, they read quite differently here. Uh, but the message is still quite clear from Paul, isn't it? Um, I hope that you guys all have a great day today. Looking forward to the weekend, perhaps. And uh, I hope you have something maybe fun planned for this coming weekend. Have a good day, my friends. I will see you soon.